For nearly 40 years, men and men alone have enjoyed an exclusive front row seat to the football action in Iran. International matches, Asian Cup matches, the big games, never a woman in sight. And so Thursday, October 10, 2019, will go down in the history books as the day the beautiful game was open to everyone in the country. Women were allowed to enter the stadium to watch the men's national team take on Cambodia in a World Cup qualifier. It cannot be put into words. It's unbelievable for me. The moment I bought my ticket, I was in tears. I never thought this day would come. As an Iranian woman, this is the first day that I enter the stadium after 40 years. I'm so happy and I hope that it will continue and the rest of the women who couldn't make it, make it to the next match. The government's about turn came after a fan set herself alight after her arrest for trying to sneak into a football match. Iran had drawn considerable criticism, most notably from FIFA, who had been pushing for the game to be opened up to women. Only three and a half thousand tickets were made available to women to watch this World Cup qualifier. The stadium has a capacity of 80,000. And the women were seated separately from the men. Uh, seated behind me are the Iranian female audiences, who through the efforts of the country's sport and the Football Federation were able to watch this national game. This is a great event. Belongs to Iranian people and country sport, and I also herewith announce that FIFA and any other organizations have had no hand in this regard. It rained goals at the Azadi Stadium in the capital, Tehran. Iran putting 14 past their opponents without reply. The flattering scoreline has propelled the team to the top of their qualifying group. While Iran's women are celebrating their part in football history, questions remain over whether they'd be allowed to watch domestic league matches. Those are not governed by FIFA. Robert Adams, TRT World.